Hey, what's up, folks? In this week's project, we're making Cappy from Mario Odyssey. In this video, we'll show you how to use Adafruit's Monster Mask and attach it to your hat with our 3D printed case. The Adafruit Monster Mask is an all-in-one board that's designed for beginners looking to add electronics to their projects. With the Monster Mask, you can customize the eyes to match the theme of your character. The board is designed so it can be split apart and joined back together with a cable. So you can separate the eyes or bring them closer together, which is great for projects like Cappy. It's really easy to customize the look of the eyes. Just open the text file and change things like the size of the iris or the color of the pupils. Check out the learn guide for a quick start and read through all of the different options you can play around with. The guide covers everything you need and there's a lot of great projects for inspiration. You can get the parts to build this project, links are in the description. Download the files and 3D print the parts. If you need to make any changes, you can modify the source file and remix the design. We got this really nice cappy hat from Amazon. It's got padded polyester, so it feels pretty comfortable. You can separate the eyes using flush diagonal cutters. Just follow the perforated holes. Be sure to do this in a well-ventilated area to avoid breathing in any dust. With the PCB separated, you can connect them back together with a 9-pin JST-SH cable. This gives you about 10 centimeters of distance. For this project, we'll bring them closer together. Start by installing them into the case. You can use M3 nylon screws to secure them to the built-in standoffs. An electronic screwdriver makes this much easier. This 500 milliamp LiPo battery should give you about three hours of battery life. You can use foam tape to stick it behind the PCB. The eye covers are printed in white PLA filament and super glued on top of the case. Next, we'll need to remove the existing eyes from the hat. Start separating them by pulling apart the edges. We used a ceramic blade to slice through the glue. We were pretty careful not to cut the fabric or any of the threads. You'll want to take your time if you want to salvage these eyes. The 3D printed case is large enough to cover up any of the glue stains or strands of thread. To attach the case to the hat, we used a needle and thread. We designed tabs on the side of the case so you can stitch it to the hat. You can create a running stitch by passing the needle in and out of the fabric. Just be sure to make a knot and tie off the thread to keep it from coming undone. And there you have it! That's how you can make Mario's Cappy with animated eyes. If you have any projects you'd like to share, we invite you to come on Adafruit Show & Tell livestream. Attendees get a free vinyl sticker. Also be sure to join Adafruit's Discord server and become a part of the community. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.